In this tutorial, we would like to do a slightly more complex setup. This time, we would like to record both ourselves, the guest in the studio, and a guest on Zoom. And on top of that, we would also like to play back some audio clips that everyone can hear. And just to add an extra layer of complexity, let's record the clips we play back during the interview. This is typically a setup that is nearly impossible to set up without an advanced sound desk and a very patient sound engineer. Let's see how we can do it with Hindenburg and the Vocaster. Begin by setting the first track as the host track. Choose host from the input selector. The second track is for the guest in the studio, so we choose guest. Next, let's add the guest we have on Zoom. In Zoom, we use the Vocaster for microphone and speakers. That's all you need to do. And now let's add it to track three by choosing loopback one. Now all the participants are ready to be recorded. The last thing that we would like to do is select a track for recording the audio clips that we're going to play back during the interview. On track four, we choose loopback two. This will record the output of Hindenburg. By the way, make sure that the output monitor is turned off, otherwise you'll get some really nasty feedback. Let's see if it works. We can play back clips from the clipboard. Pretty cool, man. It's pretty cool how they, uh, how you can set that up and... And here we see them being recorded. It was so easy. It's really that simple. We hope that the Vocaster and Hindenburg Pro will give you a nice podcasting experience. Please like and subscribe to the channel.